Shazam! Isis Hour. A full hour of exciting adventure with the world's most powerful mortals. Captain Marvel, champion of truth and justice. And Isis, dedicated foe of evil. Both together in the Shazam! Isis Hour. Chosen from among all others by the immortal elders Solomon, Hercules, Atlas, Zeus, Achilles, Mercury, Billy Batson and his mentor travel the highways and byways of the land on a never-ending mission to right wrongs, to develop understanding, and to seek justice for all. In time of dire need, young Billy has been granted the power by the immortals to summon awesome forces at the utterance of a single word. Shazam! which transforms him in a flash into the mightiest of mortal beings, Captain Marvel! Having a pet can be a lot of fun. But it does carry responsibilities. And some animals are born to be free. To deprive them of that right is selfish. So we must all understand and respect the laws of nature, both for our sake as well as for our animal friends. Stay tuned for this week's episode of ISIS. When Cindy accepts a foolish dare, she finds herself in real danger, from which only Isis can save her. sorcerer to Hatshepsut, with this amulet, you and your descendants are endowed by the goddess Isis. With the powers of the animals and the elements, you will soar as the falcon soars, run with the speed of gazelles, and command the elements of sky and earth. Three thousand years later, a young science teacher dug up this lost treasure and found she was heir to the secrets of Isis. And so, unknown to even her closest friends, Rick Mason and Cindy Lee, she became a dual person, Andrea Thomas, teacher. Oh, mighty Isis. And Isis, dedicated foe of evil, defender of the weak, champion of truth and justice. <laughs> to Isis. When someone dares you to do something, it's often something that's either dangerous or wrong to do for some other reason. So the real question isn't whether you have the guts enough to do it or not. The question is, do you have enough nerve not to take the dare? Doing anything that you know is wrong is dumb because you're the one who'll pay for it. See you next week.